Well, it looks like Jim Harbaugh may be leaving Michigan after all, and it's now being reported that Jim Harbaugh and the LA Chargers are close to striking a deal. And this deal could happen within a few days, and I have seen some people say within a few hours, but when I saw this report, I was at work, and that was eight hours ago. So it doesn't seem like they're going to be striking a deal, at least not today. And I got that feeling that Jim may be playing kind of back and forth with the Atlanta Falcons because it seems to me that the Atlanta Falcons are very interested in him as well and Belichick and so there's some type of game being played back and forth and when I say game I'm specifically talking about contract negotiation tactics so Jim Harbaugh what happens if he leaves and some things that Michigan needs to think about when it comes to hiring a new head coach we're going to get into all of that in this video so make sure that you guys subscribe like and also comment down below your thoughts and opinions on Jim Harbaugh should he leave should he stay is he making the right decision let me know down below and with that let's get into this video so Jim Harbaugh leaving Michigan seems to be all but a done deal and this time it feels more real than it did previously the man is coming off of a national championship win he did exactly what he set out to do when he became the head coach of the Michigan Wolverines and so now he's at a point where he can honestly make any decision that he wants and I think most people would be fine with whatever he decides to do Michigan fans from what I've seen have looked at this situation and really are fine if Jim Harbaugh leaves because they got a championship out of it and I think they really just want the saga to be over Michigan fans let me know if I'm wrong about that but that's the kind of feeling that I'm getting anytime I see a Michigan fan comment in the comment section and on top of that it just feels like this coaching search is just being dragged out by these teams as well as Jim Harbaugh so we really just want to know where will Jim Harbaugh be coaching next year because there's a lot of different things that may go down if he decides to leave and we're going to get into that in a second but I do want to make this clear as well if the Chargers hire Jim Harbaugh I honestly think they are making the best decision and to me honestly out of all the names that are out there right now Jim Harbaugh and Bill Belichick are the two that I would want coaching my and on the other side of that Michigan what happens if Jim Harbaugh leaves well for one it's being reported that Jim Harbaugh will take his defensive coordinator Jesse Minter with him as well if he goes into the NFL and he's going to take his son Jay it says right here and so with that being said you're going to be losing out on your DC however I believe and honestly I think a lot of people believe that you need to promote the offense coordinator Sharon Moore and I honestly believe there are two main reasons that you should keep Sharon Moore around and why he should definitely be next Michigan head coach one he did a great job while Jim Harbaugh was gone I honestly believe that he showed that he can work with this same group of kids and get some results from it and the thing about it is he is a in-house guy and that brings me to my number two reason which is he has the best opportunity to retain the players that are actually in the house because as we all know once you let a coach go or once a coach decides to leave the transfer portal opens up and all hell breaks loose it's a bidding war here it's a bidding war there and we know the kids can go in and everywhere and people are going to try to throw some money at them to come aboard and that's a situation that could be somewhat contained if you decide to hire a guy who looks to be in my honest opinion someone that the kids enjoyed playing for while Jim was gone now I know they were playing for Jim and that was the motivation because they had the whole slogan of Michigan versus the world but you had a guy who was in that fight with you in Michigan versus the world and so why not hire that guy and this brings me to my next point why are there people bringing up Brian Kelly's name in this? I don't know what Brian Kelly's buyout would be, but in my honest opinion, it probably isn't worth it. And on top of that, you're going to lose a lot of players. Could you re-up later on? Is Brian Kelly a better coach than Sharon Moore in this current time? Yes. But Sharon Moore hasn't had the time to prove that he can be a better coach than Brian Kelly. Brian Kelly has just been doing it longer, so he has a longer resume. But nothing about Brian Kelly makes me want to hire him on the spot right now over a guy who has been 
in the building already who could have just as much success probably in the future so go and make that hire there will always be a chance to go out and get a bigger fish name in the future if Sharon Moore for some reason doesn't pan out you will always have that chance but you have a guy in the house who has been sitting listening watching Jim do exactly what he has been doing and so why not give the guy a shot because it looks like Jim Harbaugh is out the door either that's to the Chargers or or wherever that may be. Seen people say, well, maybe this is some ploy in order to get the Michigan Wolverines to agree to put in those incentives where he won't get in trouble if like the NCAA finds something or like sanctions or something like that goes down, whatever happens, he won't be in risk of getting fired, different things like that I've seen thrown around the internet. And people are saying, look, he wants that if he decides to come back, but he is actually for real about going back to the NFL. Both things could be true at the same time. So let me know what you guys think about this entire situation. Is Jim Harbaugh gone? Should they hire Sharon Moore over Brian Kelly or anybody else who may be out there for that matter? Because I've been seeing Brian Kelly's name thrown around. I don't know where that rumor came for. Maybe there is some fire behind that, but I don't know it just doesn't make sense at least not right now in my honest opinion let me know what you think down below in the comment section don't forget to like comment and also subscribe i'll see you in the next video